Okay, I wish there was a better place to like show movement off, but I think this would be fine. In this game, you have a like set speed or like running, right? About 11 to 12 miles per hour, it kind of fluctuates. If you input a strafe key, you will increase that speed. That's why you almost always want to be holding W and A or W and D. And while you're holding that, if you look in that direction, you will see how you will gain a little bit of speed. And this is important for the future because when you're doing this and you jump, when you chain jumps, your speed will increase and keep going up and up and up and up when you do that. Uh, while running will give you a certain speed as well. I think the max is probably 30, I want to say. If you stay on the wall, around there, 25 to 30. The thing is you get a like an additional speed boost, kind of like Titanfall, if you attach and you detach quickly. It's kind of in, it's kind of tied into, uh, we'll be strafing out and in and out and in, and while you're doing that, you're gaining speed. But what gains you that speed is strafing in the air. Okay, so I was playing around with it. You do gain a speed boost. It is roughly 10 miles per hour. Sometimes you get a little bit less. But if you look, I'm at like 28 and I walk, hop off the wall and it gives me about 8 there. See, if you like chain over and over again and if you're completely lost and you have no idea what I'm talking about like moving your mouse like this if you move too far like this when you're doing it you're not gonna get any speed you're just gonna lose speed there's a certain like small area you have to play around with it used to that will gain you speed because if you do it too much you see like you will completely stop it's a very slow movement as well you don't want to just like jerk it because that also makes you lose speed as you can see you will fall to your death uh, one thing that is like titanfall is you can use grenade boost which I don't think a lot of people have realized yet. If you throw a nade, and depending on where that nade is, like if it's directly under you, it's gonna fling you upward. If it's behind you, it's gonna fling you in that direction, obviously. And you can use this by throwing and doing that strafe and jump and move your mouse. Because when you do that, you're gonna get up to about 20, but if you throw a nade and do that, it'll get you up to like 25 to 30 immediately. So you'll you'll gain additional speed, so it helps. Especially at like the beginning of a gauntlet run. Yeah, see, like 30 to 35 immediately instead of not doing that. And yeah, only getting up to maybe 30. If you're lucky, it takes longer to. Um, sliding is kind of useful, not really. If you're going downhill and for some reason you've lost your speed, you come to a stop. If you just slide, that'll get you up to 25 a lot faster than strafe jumping to try to get up to it, as you can see there. Um, what else, what else? 
Um, using the dash forward. It's kind of hard to tell what exactly the speed increase is, but you do get a temporary speed increase, obviously. But it, I, what I like to use it for mostly is micro movements. So say I'm, I'm flying down this way, and I'm gonna continue going this way. Well, I want to kind of wall hop to gain some speed, right, and maybe gain some height too. Well, instead of like coming all the way over here and hopping onto the wall, I will dash towards it, and then you can dash forward, and then you'll be coming along, and instead of going towards the wall again, you'll dash towards the wall, dash forward, and you just kind of repeat that, dash over, dash forward, and you'll kind of see it in the runs that I do. Dash that way, dash that way, dash that way. Obviously if you can help not mantle him, because obviously that's going to lose you all your speed. Throwing a nade to get up. Also, if you use anything that is like explosive in the game, like rocket launcher, grenade launcher, it's uh, same concept of like older games. Older games like Quake would use uh, rocket jumping, which is you're utilizing that strafe and jump, but while you're doing that, you're shooting the ground, kind of like with the grenade, it's going to launch you in that direction. So if I want to go this way, I want to put it behind me, so it'll launch me that way. So, let's see. And you can, like, use this when you have speed. If you're trying to quick change direction or something, you can shoot it. Uh, grenade launchers and rocket launchers are about the only thing I've ran into. I have played around with all the weapons that they have, but... Uh, if you have any kind of explosives, it does the same thing as the grenades, essentially. Just a little easier to use while you're flying through the air like that.